the that's the extension that went on the on the door on the right hand. Oh wow! Well, thank you very much. I appreciate it. And if well, you, and if you, and if you find them other pieces, I I would like if to. If I find them, I'll drag them down here. Yeah, now. that'd be awesome. Anyway, for now we should get going. Okay. Work See you. Thank you. You're welcome. Appreciate it. Carry on with your good videos. Okay, I, cool. I enjoy them. Right on. I never miss. <laughs> never miss. Right on. Thanks, man. Have a good day. Have a great rest of your day. Cool. I guess I'm going to say, okay, welcome back. We're back at it. Me and Doug. Doug's in the house. Jolene's on the camera. She's looking fine as ever. It's a little bit chilly here this morning. Um, it's quite a gift that he gave us, you know? You know what I mean? It's kind of nice cool. for... As long as you don't run over them. <laughs> <laughs> Set of fenders for an old Buick. I'm probably going to check and see if that Buick's still around. Um, that, that car would uh, be very impressive uh, to find that car. But anyways, right now, um, Doug has been outside turning his guts out on the front piece. We made another front piece here. Um, it's not exactly the shape it needs to be, but remember when we did it last time, he made it closed in quite heavy we had to pull it open to get the shape that we wanted so we wanted to do the exact same thing um, that's basically what we're going to do and we made another one for another wheel opening because we need some more of these these are going up pretty good so basically what we're going to do right now is we're going to try to apply another one of these stud it up and maybe start making this front so we can start seeing what it looks like all right Doug let's grab the other side there will you please let's let's just check this thing out. She, let's, let's try to open her up. All right, let's put it underneath. We're going to go underneath of this. We want to see if we get it the same shape. All right, um, um, pull yours over some more. Just pull this. No, 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 pull yours. Yeah, pull yours in more. So this is up here. It's nice. Pulled in, pulled in, pulled in, pulled in. All right. All right, we're going to have to open her up some more. All right, let's try that. We don't want to get it too far opened up, and the reason being is it's easier to open it than it is to. Well, let's get the front going right here. That's basically what we got to get going on. Pretty close right there, man, isn't it? All right, I've got, we've got a little bit too too wide. Let's get some C clamps. Let, you, let yours go in a little bit further, Doug. Let yours go in further. Let it go in further. Just let it go in like that way. Some yeah, there. Here you go. We're gonna. Actually, pull it back some. See if we can get them both the same distance. Alrighty, that's what we have to do. We'll put some C clamps. We're going to get some C clamps on here, and we're going to have to yank this out on. Not really got the the same shape. We want the same shape, but we haven't. Okay. It's not easy to get the same shape. It is not, is no, it? It is. It's let's, let's put some. Let's put some C clamps on it. It's what challenge. we're just going to do is going to put some C clamp or some C clamps, yes, C clamps on there. If we get any left, they're all there on the trailer. Oh, I can grab them, buddy. No, no problem. It's a big deal. We'll just take them off and then we'll put them back on. We just want the ones with the swivel heads, not the ones with the. Here, you can see it to get them set if you want. Get that one set. I've got clamps on every car that we own. I've got clamps on them. <laughs> Haven't we? Uh -huh. Sec Doug, we're gonna... What's gonna happen is, is this one... We're trying to get this one the same as this one so we can bring it up here and weld it on here and then we can come around. Then we can stud that up. It's always a good start to a video is getting gifts, car parts. Um, let's do this. Yours fitting pretty good, is it, Doug? Yeah, it looks great. Feels great. I'm gonna... I mean, it's not perfect. Neither am I. What? What? Who'd yeah. say? Now, when, when you clamp that, geez, it feels good, you know? Come over here and clamp mine, Doug. I just want to see if we can get this one straightened out. A little tighter, buddy.
Nice, nice try. <clears throat> She's kind of heavy. I think we're gonna have a hard time with this. It's not the easiest thing to do, man. Is yours sitting pretty good over on your end? It's a little out past, right from about here to the end. Okay, let's bring it all bring it all the way this way. So maybe we have to cut any off. Maybe we can get that get it out of that part. No, not gonna do that. Let's take it your way more. Okay. It feels pretty good there. It feels great. Like, okay, it feels there, good there. But, but it's just like I said, it's a little out past here. All right, keep going your way then. Okay. Now they're a little bit. Jeez, I want that the same. I don't, you know, if you know what I'm trying to tell you. That's mess. Come my hard. way a little bit. Pretty hard to do, dude. I'm just gonna work at it. Okay. Let's flop it over. I'll give you yours. your feel pretty good oh pass almost width of the that's better about the same man about the same now good it's now yeah, now it's out it's out past quite a bit on the side now push it in that feel good now it's out past here a lot you can't see it on the edge of the bar but with my finger sticking out by here okay can you line it up line it up with this piece here like your end Okay. Okay. Right there. No. 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 This piece on this this piece because we're well, we're we're gonna weld it on. We're gonna fix that. So you gotta move. Put this one right here. No. Put more. Put more. You gotta move that. More. 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 That fits. No. Ah. That's no. That's not fit so good, is it? No. Nope. Fits good over this side. No. Shift too far right there. Way too far. All right. Pull it back then, I guess. Now, I'm going to put my end on. How's that? Sounds my good. end's on. How's your fit? No. So can out past in here, out here. Pretty hard to hold that and, and, uh, damn it. <clears throat> yeah, definitely tricky. What's that? It's definitely going to be tricky. I wonder if we stud it up and then blade it on top and pulled it around to it. Maybe. That might work. If you know what I'm trying to say. Yep. If we set it up 21 and a half and wall one there and then bring it around. This fit pretty good over here, I guess. Come my way a little bit. How's yours fitting? That's better. Is it? Yeah, that's a lot better. Are we out? We're out yeah. a little bit in the front. But I mean... Okay. It's... Oh, sticking out a bit here. It's just, close, man. And that just needs to come in. It's close. Look at that. This is in the way to stick that on. This, you know what I mean? I like to stick it on, maybe get it the same shape. But Yours is okay on the front. I'm going to mark this one so we can cut it. You got yours going good? It's sticking out quite far right here. Hold it there, clamp, or clamp, put a clamp on there. No, do it the other way like, like you had it. Do it the other way like you had it there, if you can. Oh, too far. Um, can you go back some? Just go, go, hey Doug. Can you go back that way just a little bit so you look like you're you're just gonna we just want it up up against this here part here if it will Let's take it back in a little bit Whoa, right there okay. maybe you can take it yeah you got it close in just a little bit further if you will yeah pretty good i guess Want me to help you hold that over there? No, but I'll get her eventually. And just a little bit, if you will. 
just let go in that go in towards the truck a little bit i leave it there leave it um clamp it again all right let that go <coughs> clamp a, another one on it as we come along here so it stays on the same i just want i just want to know where to cut it so is it fitting good all the way along there it's pretty close man very close off our eighth as usual what's that we're off an eighth here as usual it's just so close right is that good there now the back where it fits good you know if you're fitting right here good, yeah okay okay put that clamp on there please all right let's clamp that this goes right yep. here so we're going here probably gonna have to weld it that's what i was thinking too all right it's what you usually do okay yeah three clamps that's that's pretty good over there on that side it's not too bad it's uh it's out a little bit so if i weld it then i can pull this out to make it work i don't know if i can reach that far or not you gotta look, you gotta look at it from this angle right here it's like let's see, out here and a little bit here really hard to get this perfect just like the other well, once ones. we get the studs up and then we can make it we can make her fit make it fit basically we probably just could put it on anyways i'm just gonna you want to hold that with your hand there so it don't fall off just kind of hold it i'm gonna pull this out Jeez. does not want to and the clamp know. yeah clamp it if you will i got that stone little bugger here are we not we are it's the best looking yet is we've had it that's yeah, close to being up there i can i'm gonna cut it off so we know the length if i cut it off there we should be fine we're close and the reason being is over there a little bit and then we'll stud it up and set it on all we can like basically if the studs stay up straight which i don't know if they will or not just weld them on there and stand them up straight and i don't know even know where i'm putting the studs but yeah that went bad all righty I wonder if we put welded on and then yanked on it and I'm not sure. Let's cut this side, let's take it off and we'll, we'll cut this side off and then I'll see if I can weld some studs up to hold it in place. Take her off? Just sure. a minute now. If I, I could weld some metal on the face of it and so it can't go you know what i mean weld a piece of combing up straight here so it can't go around it yeah. so it would stay in the same position that would keep it there and i wonder if we welded it on there if we could pull it and tug it and bend it that way i'm not sure hmm. it right. usually only bends it in one spot and that's quite long. thick stuff so yeah it's, and i was thinking about putting it on the the wood over there and hitting it with the hammer but it's quite a long piece to yeah it is yeah let's let's take it off yes. all right i'm gonna cut this piece off Drop that. Fits good there, but it doesn't give it doesn't tell us if it's round like it's different shape down there, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it fits from there to there and pretty damn perfect. Close. Yeah. But it's not off by our usual eight. Right? And this has not got the same bend here. No. Yours got the same bend looking down there? Not really. 
And then she gets really wonky once you come over here. Right along here. I wonder if I can put that on something, bend that. I could relief it. It'd be really hard to bend it and get it right. Put it back on there for a sec. See, I'm way off down here, like it's just... I could relief it. Let's set it down again on top. All right, let's put it underneath. Come back some, Douglas. Jeez, I'm right where I'm supposed to be. We're just looks well, still too long, don't it? Yeah, stuck out in the front huh? too quite a bit. So is your is your sides fitting really? Like is your side like this piece here fitting really good? He like. Right along here, it does. Yeah, so it's a, we've got too much in the center. Yeah. So what if we took it and cut it in half and weld it back together? Sounds good. Okay, I'm going to put a clamp on my side. I'm going to clamp it where you know it's going to be welded on here, eh? If you know what I'm trying to tell you. Like, you got to have it not long enough, so... So you're fitting pretty good there, there? Not, not bad. Not like bad. No, I mean. you have to come see this here. That piece has to come up here because this is where we're welding on here, okay? We'll just let it off. I should, I didn't have to take mine off, but. Sticking out a little bit. Clamp rears on. Can you clamp yours on? Is it fitting pretty good now? It's sticking in here. Okay, pull it out. It's almost flush right there. See, mine's sticking in there too a little bit. So when I pull mine over, does it affect yours? Yep. Draws it all in towards the vehicle. Alrighty. Gotta have it the same, or we've got. Seems like we got too much, don't it? Huh? Our bend's all wrong, son. The bend is all wrong, isn't it? Yeah. Really hard to get it the same by hand. I wonder if we bend it again, or cut it in half, and then make it go where it needs to go. Yeah, why? It's not in a bend there, is it? No, it's sticking out quite a ways. Uh, and I've got this, and I've got the same thing going on. Let me see your clamp pebbles. Please and thank you. It's going to, we're going to do the best we can with what we got. All right, now, if I relieved I'm not going to put it back in the bending machine. We're good to here, and we're good to here. Yeah, Both we're good same. in a few spots. So I'm going to relief it. I'm going to relief it in the center of the biggest. Mark that out. Now, are you not going to have just, to cut this in half for like a door here, anyways? I'll relief it here. Just got to put a few marks in it, I guess, where it needs to be relieved. Yeah, there's gonna be a door in here, but I gotta, I wanna stud it up, make it. Got the same thing going on here. But not as much on this side as it is. I'm not sure what to do with it. Swear at it, hit it with a hammer. Well, it just seems like it's got more of a bend here. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, it's sticking out half inch right here. Or put it in the center and pull it out. Let's try that. 
All right, take it off. Keep your keep your position though. Yep. If you can. Let's push it in the center. Okay, I just got it bent. That's good for me now. If I just do that, then I can. That's good. I'm gonna pull mine out. Fits good there. How's yours fit when you pull it out, Douglas? Pull it out. We're almost the whole Pull it out. Pull it out. Pull it out. Oh. That fits good. That fits good. That fits good. That fits good. It's just the ends. Just the end. Yeah, I'm just gonna relief it. So That's better. We're supposed to be there, right? Yeah. Yeah. And this when this pulled out it. Let's do this. Um, we're flush there. Let's relief it there. Actually, I'm gonna come back just a little bit. Got four marks. There's where we're gonna relief it. This side. How far we pass that? But the same. Beautiful. We'll leave that and pull that into work. Let's take it off. Just a second. I want to make sure we get it back together somewhat. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. Now, we had to bend that. We had to bend that to get that where it was, didn't we? Did we not? Had to force it, yeah. Let's, yeah. Let's, let's, let's open her up some more then. All right, let's try it again. Just put it up there quickly. How you feeling? I know you feel with your hand. Open her up more. We could open her up more. Mine's good on my side. Yeah, it's still stuck out. All right. Where's the center? Go ahead, pull it down, Doug. Yeah, try that. Well, oh, I'm <laughs> stuck way out now. Yeah, well, that's where we're going to relieve it. We want to get Perfect. this, this middle stuff fitting before we cut it. That's all I'm saying. Go ahead. I'm, I'm going to do mine now. Go ahead. What's that sweeter? I'm gonna have to come out a little bit of mine, Douglas, a little bit further of mine. How's your fitting? I'm out by still. Okay, you're fine. Yeah. Do a little bit more. Let's try that. I'm fitting, I'm doing pretty good now. Good. Uh, I'm pretty good now. How's yours? Just bend out further more. Okay, bend out further more? Yeah. I don't have to relief mine as far this time now. More than, more than half of it's fitting good, so. Let's, I want to clamp it just so I can see what's going on. Might not have to. Yeah, I don't have to do much of mine. It's fitting good, fitting good, fitting good, fitting good, fitting good. Oh wow! Now it's coming in further. Center, fitting better now, baby. Yeah. I'm gonna relief it there. Cross that out because it's fitting good. Fitting good. Yeah. You still could be released about there. All right, let's let it down.
does kind of give it a, like a little kink going on, but I kink. But I'm just gonna open her up. Put her back on, dog. Just a bit. That's fine. Good now. Got yours put in place, do you, Doug? Pretty close, man. A little bit on the end. Do I need to slice it again to make it feel... Maybe I should hit it there and do another one just to make it yeah. a little better. Okay, just you just hold. hold. Yep. Right, just a little tiny bit there. If I can't drag that welder around far enough. Open. Come on, baby. It does not matter about that. Right on. I do want to hit that, take it in just a bit. Just a bit. So in order to get that in there, we want to kick it over here or cut it over there somewhere. Get a marker. You can see your end here. See your end? Yeah. Yep. Close. Very close. Up right there. No, we'll go back. And I'm going to go back this side. See what I'm doing. in there just a bit. That's better. That better. Stop it. Well that sucker up. Shut that off. Take it down. We'll cut one more cut. Put it back in order. And then uh, we'll put it on. Sweet. Basically all I'm doing, or what, I, what I'm doing here is, it's not fitting the same front. I don't, this is the front that we have, this is the front we're going by, we're trying to make this the same. What I'm doing when I cut that open, 
I'm cutting it open so we can bend it in. We could not bend it in. It's too thick a wall. It's probably eighth at least. And what I'm doing is I'm cutting it there, reliefing it so it can open up. So that, that there opened up a bit. We are stretching it somewhat. We are stretching it. And then we're welding it back together as it fits. And I know where to relief it is because when the, when the metal comes along, it runs along and it starts not fitting, that's exactly where I'm going to relief it because that's where I want to pull it in to make it work. So I'm just, I'm just running along the edge of it. Wherever it starts poking out, not working, I go back to where it's flush, cut it there, and then we'll bend it in. That's what's happening. Let's get this back on. Yo! We're off there just a little bit before. Doug's poked on already, so I guess that's where it's going. Probably could. I'm in there a ways. No, not too bad. No, nope. a little ways. Went in for you, Doug. No problem. Yep. Just piss? Just a little bit right there. We'll just put it in like that? Put it in like that, yeah. Put it in like that. Good to me. Okay, I'll have to pull that front up. You can see how that opened up in the front. We're close. We're a little out there. We'll see what happens. We're pretty close. When God made you, Doug, did he make you perfect? Hell no. <laughs> So it's okay if I don't make this perfect? We're doing great for a couple guys in the garage. <laughs> what? Man. For a couple guys in the garage, we're doing great. Awesome. We'll get it. We'll get like, it. As we always do. There you go. Hard work will prevail. Hard work. Oh yeah, Doug worked hard this morning, I didn't. I just put some studs in. He he went and did all the rolling. He felt so right for me too. <laughs> All right, that should hold it. We're in there a little bit. Nothing we can't work with. All right, man. We're pretty darn close. We're pretty darn close. Better than it was before. Pretty darn close. All righty. Now we need to make... I'll make two... I think we'll go with... I don't know if these pieces are staying here or not. I have no idea. No idea. No idea. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a couple studs that go on here. I think it's, it's 21 and a half. That's what we got to go along the side here is 21 and a half. So if we go 21 and a half in the front there, I'm hoping that we'll run right on top of that and bring it over there. So we'll cut, or I'm going to cut two studs. Bear with me, Douglas. Bear with me. I will. I already worked hard this morning. Oh, yeah. That's right, yeah. We could actually... I mean, you said it. We could actually throw one stud on. Let's see what happens. I got the zip cut there. Thank you. At 21 and a half it is, pretty sure. Factory cut edge. My cut edge. I taught you well. You did. <laughs> um. I don't know where center is. And it'd probably be better with two than than one, would it not? For sure. 
I'm gonna make two. We'll stick them on here. I'd like to know where they're exactly going. How, how do I tell a measurement? Well, maybe we'll take a measurement. We'll do it from, we'll do this. I don't know. I don't know. Let's go from, let me just put a measurement here, Doug, for a second. Corner. Forty. Yes. Forty. Yeah. Okay, forty. We'll just stick it on that side of that one. Geez, them are close, eh? I didn't realize they're that close. But anyways, we'll stick it on there. Let's stick it on like this. And the reason being is because the metal's gonna wrap around, right? You know what I'm saying? Yep. Cool. Let's do that. On the bubble, Doug. I'll hold down here. You hold on. Where's the mark at? It's on my side, okay. unfortunately. You can't see yeah. it. That's fine. You hold it on the bubble. You do the bubble thing. How's okay. that? You got the bubble? Bubble looks good. Does the bubble look good? It looks bubbly. Still bubble? Yep. Goes, it wants to go wonky after you let off it, right? So, perfect. Yeah. Yeah, it wants to move so badly, right? It does. As you Put the bubble on again? Yes. Which way? It's got to go that way a little bit. A little bit more. Right there. Okay. Let's do this. Sweet. We're still on our marks anyways. Holy wow, that bubble's still on. I'm gonna attack that again. I, <laughs> don't amaze me, Doug. <laughs> Watch your eyes. Just tacking it. Yeah, so it stayed, stayed put. Okay, cool. Let's do this one. Excellent. Do you want the other side for the mark or do you want me to hold on the mark? Either or other, man. Either way, we'll get her. Keep going. You hold the bubble. Got the bubble? Yeah. Push it over my way a little bit. Push it over. A little bit further. Right there. Got it? Yeah. Let's do let's do back and forth this way. Which way? Okay, pull it out. Keep pulling her out. Get your bubble. Uh, get your bubble on. Yeah. Got your bubble on. Double cut my bubble on. Bubble it. Got her now. Yeah. Good. Still got it. You can just got just a little bit, man. Give her a tug. <laughs> that one. That's good. That's straight. Probably could have, maybe a little bit. Yeah, just a little bit, right? No, he can't tug too. 
I guess you cut that and put that on, should you think, or what? Mm. Let's put the, the, the square stock on top of it that we've got cut underneath. Let's stick that on top and see what happens. It see might push happens. it out. It might take all this stuff off. It will all come together. Alrighty. Pull this band away. You out on yours, are you? This, that one's good on your Pretty side, good, eh? good, yeah. This one's got to come out. It's, you know why it's got to come out? Because, remember, it's pushing it out anyways? Yeah. Got to keep that good. I'm going to nail this side on. Okay. That side might need a shim, or might need to be sliced back a little bit to make that one, because that one fits perfect, doesn't it? That one looks like it fits perfect, yes. Okay, so. And yeah, it does. Feel so too. I'm just going to tack this bad boy for now. And the reason being is we don't know exactly what's going on. So we look it over. Probably my best bet would be to uh, just tack everything on. And the good, another good thing too, I was that one there has to be pushed out to make a, the bubble out. better. See, it I makes the bubble better when it goes out long. Yeah. I'm actually gonna, nope, I'm gonna tack this side on. Can you push that in, Doug? Or, do, or needs to, nope, need to cut some off it. Okay. This one here is good, can you? I just wanna do this. See, that one's good, that one tells right on, so basically I should cut some off that with a zip cut. Get that in there a little tighter. You want to hold that with your hand, just kind of hold it so it don't. Ah, uh, you can put it up. Well, just a second. I want to cut that a little. Fitting perfect there now, isn't it? Yeah, beautiful, isn't it? Whoop, whoop. All right. Attack that on that. Now, where that fit like that, so perfect on that, we're going to nail it. That's straight up and down, is it not? Beautiful. That's good in man. Gonna tack this one over here. This one here is not. If you want to get that level, Doug, and just show what's going on, put it on this way. So, in actually fact, if we bring that out, fits better, doesn't it? Sure does. Right on. Are you still in the bubble? On the bubble? Yeah. Hoping that we're still this way. You want to just check it out? See if we're still. That look good. Perfect. Perfect. Sweet. Alrighty. Let's sit back, sit back and look at Marvel this thing for a second. It was a bit of frustration to get it rocking and rolling. Now we really have to take a, just take a little gander at it. Just like everything, you got to work at it to make it work. Yeah, I'm just kind of wondering, like, so this is the position. This is the spot where I'm thinking that we're going to be sitting to drive it. Uh, windows are up front. If you if you look at that thing closely, uh, they're ahead of the wheels. The door is ahead of the wheels. We're, I don't know if we're going... The door is ahead of the wheels, so they're sitting up here. It looks funny right now, the present second, with this on it. But this is the front. Uh, this will sheath the metal, then the bumper. I thought this would be part of the bumper, but the bumper would be out beyond that. Um, now it's up into that. 
not quite sure. I like to look at that thing too, but um, I'm not sure. It's okay. I'll look at it after. But this is the front of it. Windows are going to be here. We have a couple pieces back here. I'm just going to take a look here. Now, now it's time to take a little bit and take a look and see what's going on. We've got these pieces here that are part of our roof racks or our roof trusses. And I'm thinking that would continue up to that. So we're going to have to roll some. So we will. So would it be a be a window here? A window here, and then a window around there. It's going to look funny. Um, we're going to have to roll. Maybe roll a couple of pieces and um, see if we can't get a piece to go in here. Do you want to put a piece in it there? Looks, it looks like it's going that way pretty good by the eye. Does it look like Can it? do that, yes. Okay, Here, I'll hold I'm, I'm going to cut. Go for it. Hold yeah. it. I want to see it. I, stand back I want to see it. It looks like it could come up further and then roll. Yeah. Yeah. Right, yeah. Hold it up straighter, if you will, Doug. Like, yeah. Use that piece up there. What's that? Use that piece up there. Um, we just want a, a slight grade going on here, yeah. and then we want to turn it down. You know, but just a more or less like that thing there going on. I'm not thinking that. Just put that down there again, Doug. I can add some too. We've got lots of angle right here, and what I'm thinking is I've got a piece of angle out of that. Nope, it has to come up straighter. Come up, yeah, but just yeah, it's got to come up like that. Yeah, yeah, and um, that's our middle mark. I'm thinking if we I'm gonna have to look at that picture a little bit, but can you see a window there? Yeah, see that it makes looks like a window would come there, a window would go there. We're up straighter in the front, and we don't have. We're not built. We're, we're you know we're not building exact. We're looking at a picture and going for it. But what I'm thinking is, if you want to take that, see how that, see how it's straighter up front, Doug, in the yeah. center. We've got quite a curve going on there. First thing, yeah. I'm thinking if if this was lengthened out, and then the curve made. You know, this. Hmm. It's going to be quite an angle going on there from that curve there to there. So, so you know, could we not take a piece of wire and bend that? that we out? can. We can and then make the piece from that. Yeah. Yeah. Lift it up some, Doug. Yep. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna cut the ends off of the. I got we got a piece here made for the wheel. Um, these, let me see that, Doug, please. These are the ends that we made off of these. I got Doug to roll another one for a wheel, so we can have a couple more of these things. Um, they're exact now that we can do that. There's a couple. For the roof racks, we need a couple more roof rafters. Where are we at? 56? Oh, well, miles of wait till we come back. Uh, alrighty, so what's going on at the present moment? We've got our little place that we're, our seating area. We got that fitting good. I'm real happy with the seating area. It's nice and round. It's fitting good. Looks good. That's the main thing. You can see it now. I hope you can see it. Uh, metal wrapped all the way around this. Headlight. Headlight wrapped around, wrapped. I'm not sure if we're going for a door, but I did manage to. If Joey wants to come show you, I took some um, and studded it up here. So this is going to be toolbox, toolbox, and it's got two studs. A stud up on, on the front, of the, on the 
front side of the wheel here and then I start up again it gives me a little bit of meat for metal in between there a little metal in between there metal in there I made the same distance it's almost the size of your, your wheel sort of so we're not too far out and then it's metal up and over have to figure out what I'm going to do for the engine quickly and the reason quickly is because I cannot sheathe anything over this part until I figure that out all right everybody Thanks for coming back. We appreciate it. And uh, keep commenting. Keep sending your suggestions and do all that sort of stuff. Like, share, uh, subscribe. Do as you please. Jolene will get back and take a little look at the front of it. It almost looks like, I don't know, something that Jamie L's got over there for the cattle. <laughs> yeah, it does, doesn't it? Maybe we could have cut the front off that and put it on there. <laughs> but anyways, we've got the front matched up. It took us a little bit to get it, but I think we have it. Uh, now we just got to figure out what we want for that to look right in the front. Have a great day, everybody. Me and Doug and Jolene are.